Hi, it's Dr. Steve Weiner, and I'm going to talk to you today about hyaluronidase, specifically Hylinex, which is the preferred uh, brand that I use. So what hyaluronidase is, it's a dissolver of filler. I call it the magic eraser. So for all of the hyaluronic acid fillers, which include Juvederm, Restylane, Restylane Silk, Restylane Lift, Voluma, um, those can be dissolved using Hylinex very easily. So if, if you have any apprehension about getting those types of fillers, keep in mind that they can be dissolved rather easily and quickly using hyaluronidase. And how it works is it, it's an enzyme that's naturally occurring in your body that you inject in the area where the filler is. So if it's a little bit lumpy, if it's a little bit uneven, or you just don't like the effect, you can inject it with the hyaluronidase and within minutes you start to see the effect. Within 24 hours to 48 hours you see the full result. Oftentimes, particularly with the Luma and Juvederm, you need to do this more than once, but oftentimes only two times is needed. Um, the other time that you use this, which is very important, is when you have vascular occlusion. That's when a blood vessel is injected directly with the filler. Now that doesn't really happen much when you use cannulas, but when you're using needles, it can occur because the needle can enter the blood vessel and you can inadvertently inject the filler into the blood vessel. What that does is it causes the blood vessel to uh, not profuse the area and you get something called necrosis, which is uh, dead tissue. And so if, if you the provider recognizes that there is a vascular occlusion, he immediately injects with this and flushes the area to try to dissolve that filler. That's a very rare occurrence, but it, it's needed in every office. If you go to an office that doesn't carry hyaluronidase, then you should probably leave because that's a necessary uh, piece of all offices that inject HA fillers, just in the case there's an emergency like that. So, uh, Hylinex, the magic eraser, this is the genetically modified version that's human, uh, exactly like the human form of hyaluronidase. There are others called vitrates and hyalinase, which are uh, animal derived, uh, and they have a, a very small allergy to those. This does not have an allergy to it, so that's my preferred method. So if you want more information, I have a very detailed blog about this on Stephen F. Weiner, MD. Uh, you can search that on WordPress. And if you want any more information, give us a call at 850-622-1214. Thank you.